All right, so I have a surprise for you all. The name's Adam here, uh, that indie gamer, as you also know me. I run a company, an ind indie company, called Protagonist Publications. Technically, Protagonist Publications LLC, but Protagonist Publications is what we call it. Uh, and basically, we're an independent gaming company that publishes um, video games about characters in marginalized groups. and. I haven't been doing Let's Plays because I've been working on this. I just want to take you through some of the game. Not everything's programmed. There's a bug in here and it's kind of pissing me off. Um, <laughs> hold on, let me make sure I'm recording my voice. Yeah, I'm recording my voice, so that's good. Uh, and so this is just the bare bones of the game. It's not polished or anything. We're actually looking for developers for our next game, Mermaids vs. Zombies. Uh, we already have the art for that. We already got the backgrounds. We, we just need developers. I can't do it all by myself. Well, if you're a developer, you'll also be a writer, so. If you're interested in that, I'll leave Protagonist Publications email in the description. If you're really interested, uh, you wouldn't be doing art, you wouldn't be doing sound, you'd just be programming a game with all that. So, if you guys are interested, no one's gonna be interested. Just leave a comment. Or email us. But yeah! Anyways, enough with the self-plugs. <laughs> Let's- Okay, that came out wrong. Let's go with play the game. So I programmed this, and this is my game. Yeah, I'm really happy with it. What is your first name? We can't go with Adam because this is a lesbian game. It's called Lesbian Space Fire Dating Simulator. Eve. God, child. That works. <laughs> you wake up with a headache. Your head hurts. Your vision, vision is fuzzy. fuzzy. I got the voice actors and everything because I run almost the company completely by myself. I handle PR, I handle everything. You see before you and if you, you're interested in seeing more of this game, knowledge. link to our Twitter and everything about that in the description, and there's a YouTube channel with everything on it. So yeah, we're looking at Let's Players to do videos of it right now, so. <laughs> you see, it says Eve Godchild, because that's what I typed in. What's what's going on? Rose is the best voice actress, she's so fun to work with. Hush, you're awake here. So is Adox. Welcome aboard the space gauntlet. See, not everything's programmed, unfortunately. The space what? That's your voice. <laughs> your head is still quite fuzzy. Oh, really? I wrote you this so I can criticize it. Really? Oh, oh I'm just uh, I like I didn't know. Oh, okay. As okay. punishment for attacking us, you, you are now, now an official member of the space, space gauntlet. gauntlet. Welcome, Welcome to, to kitchen, kitchen duty. So not gossip. <laughs> Relax and be go easy She's a parody of Ebony and Darkness Smith, or even away from My Immortal, so if you haven't heard of that, Google My Immortal right now. Worst fan fiction of all time. But she's a stupid creep. Ugh, I hate stupid creeps. Come on. I'll introduce you to the rest of the crew. It's kinda lagging on me, but it's okay. Let's meet the rest of the crew. I don't want to talk to Envy. Okay, you meet the crew. Alright. This is Barry. I self to program his brain, unfortunately. <laughs> Hi. He seems far too he excited, excited giving your crew just protected. attacked him and failed. This is a hawk. This is Gabriella. It's Gabby, Jesus. Her her color her text color or name color is the color of her choker. Sir Captain Mindy. Nice to meet you, prisoner. Right. This is a crew. You'll be serving kitchen, kitchen duty. duty. Let's get on kitchen duty because a hawk's my child. Uh, <laughs> she is my space alien, non-human lesbian child. <laughs> so your name's weird. Native American. Oh, I said talk oh. to a hawk rather than go on kitchen duty with her. Oh shit. Okay. Let's call her ugly as fuck. I'm. I'm sorry. Oh my god. I hate she doing me too. You hear her uh. and possibly cry. You decide. Let's get. A, let's talk to Baron. You know that was really rude. Oh, he noticed. Excuse me. A hawk is sensitive, and you just insulted her like that. No wonder Mindy doesn't trust you. Let's get on kitchen duty. I don't want Mindy to yell at me. Hello. Hi. Welcome to the kitchen. I'm the main cook. Yeah, awesome sauce. I say that what? all the time. You know what I mean. She doesn't. I I really don't. Now then, we have to cook supper. Um, 
what should we make? Let's make slime pies because I'm fandom trash. I've never heard of them. Would you by chance tell me how to make You them? haven't heard of them because they're a homestuck reference. Sure. Why you forgot to mention I'm The cook's blind. I'm blind. That's brilliant. So I'll need you to guide me through the steps with your hands. Okay. Wrap your hands around a hawk's and begin to teach her the steps of making slime pie. You fandom trash- I know! That's the sad part! Like, I'm in the fandom for that other game I've been playing. I'm a fandom in everything. I'm in everything fandom. After an hour, the batter is cooked and turned into slime. Is a lot of work. Only when you're making food from scratch. By the way, you're still holding my hands. Oh, sorry. You blush incredibly. It's okay, I mean, who'd want to hold hands with me anyway? If you say she's ugly as fuck, it originally was supposed to say you would hold and hold hands with an ugly person anyways, but I messed up on that programming, so. No one. <laughs> I'm aware I'm pathetic. Maybe you should go. Oh, he's taking me to a hawk. Let's go talk to Mindy. You approach your new captain. She notices you in an instant. Greetings, prisoner. Why do you have to call me that? Well, you're a prisoner. You and your crew attacked us, and you dare demand respect. I'm same as you, a pirate. We, we don't, don't kill. Someone was killed. Don't play silly. Of course, someone was killed. I'm sorry for your loss. You were the one who killed her. Right. Again, I'm sorry. Why do you think we took you as prisoner? It certainly wasn't because you were hot. I'm so sorry. Prove it. Okay. You pull out a sword and aim it at your chest. Never mind, I believe you. So can I make it up to you? By the way, I know you're pissed, but damn, you're hot. This game is fucked up. We know, and because you said that... We will make Mindy slap you. Slap. Mindy slaps you across the face. Jesus, you're worse than Baron. Let's talk to Baron. So, um, you're hot. Fuck. This is a lesbian game and the guy hits on you. I'm into girls. Well, in that case, you're super hot. <laughs> <laughs> what even? It's beautiful. So, uh, can I join you and your girl sometime? This is beautiful. What are you talking about? <laughs> let's let's kick him in the crotch. You kick him right in the crotch. He kneels down in pain. You laugh at this. <laughs> you walk away and decide who to I talk to so much. Probably because I made it. A uh, link to where you can see more videos about it in the description. Uh, I think that's. Let's talk to Robin, go through her path, and then we'll end the end the hey, game. Robin, greetings. Is it me or does everybody want to fuck me? Oh, I'm sorry. And she I just met you. Keep this in mind. But I think I know the reason, Finn. Your eyes are like that of the night stars, beautiful and shining. Your personality bursts Best with enthusiasm at every turn. turn. Your lips are cherry and plump like Guess a rose. Guess we're white. <laughs> and you steal away our hearts with your breath. No, I'm just kidding. That was a joke. That was a terrible joke. R Robin thinks, really? Yes. I quite like you. Your spirits are high and you take away my breath with every step. But I am a prisoner. So what? You're a hot one? R Robin... I'm not gonna lie to you and say you like beauty when your very essence fills me with glee. I don't know what to say. Sorry, was that it's too forward? Just. I was just hanging with her mouth open right now. Well, kinda, don't be. I'm kind of embarrassed. Well, don't. Robin be. moves up to you and pecks you on the cheek. Come on, we're docking at a new planet soon. Wow. It's beautiful, isn't it? <laughs> I love this part. I've played this game so many like times. 
So you're. I'm, I'm your, your this. This. Sh Be quiet. <laughs> Hand on Robin's lips. Sorry. You kiss Robin as she shuts up. The next day. All right, crew. We have a raid coming up. Uh, a raid. It's when we pillage ships and attack them. Oh, that was blunt. Right, and then we fight to take control of the ships. You tried to raid us and fail, hence you being a prisoner. Right. You listen to the captain speak for hours. She finally approaches you. May I speak to you alone, prisoner? Sure. I forgot how long this game was. I mean, it's normally only eight minutes if you go through one character's path, but if you go through multiple ones at once, it's longer. I want you getting too close to Robin. Why? That's none of your business. I'm not close to her. I'm a prisoner, after all. She's gonna kill us. Maybe it's up to you. Her eyes mean yours. Bullshit. Why do you care, anyways? Cause that's for me to know, and you never to find out. If I weren't a prisoner, I'd quit. You better watch your mouth, or I'll kill you right here and now. Doubtful. Slice. She killed you. <laughs> the way he says that. You might wish to go back and try again, otherwise this will have been a very short game. <laughs> Thanks for playing. And that's Lesbian Space Fire Dating Simulator. These are the credits. It's just a screen because it's not very many people working on it. Uh, yeah. See you guys. I just want to show off my game. Link to more info about the game in the description. Uh, I'll post the blog the WordPress, our website, which is a WordPress. I'll post our Twitter, I'll post our YouTube, I'll post our email, I'll post everything, so don't worry about it. Alright, see you guys.